In this video, we will try to perform a one sample t test in Excel using the Excel inbuilt functions. Let's consider the following example. Where a sample of size 15 is drawn randomly, the population mean or the hypothesized mean is 50. This is a left tailed test because the hypothesis test includes the less than sign that is under the alternative hypothesis, the sample mean is less than the population parameter, and the significance level is set at 0.05. Now in this case, the null hypothesis states that the population mean of the sample data is 50 and the alternative hypothesis tests the claim that the population mean of the sample data is less than 50. This is a left-tailed test because the alternative hypothesis includes the less than sign. Now, we are going to perform a one-sample t-test in Excel. For that, open an Excel spreadsheet and write the sample data values in column A. First, Calculate the sample mean, the sample standard deviation, and the sample size of the data values using the Excel function shown in column E by selecting the range of the sample data values. For a one sample t test, the t statistic follows a t distribution with n minus 1 degrees of freedom that is 14. To calculate the t statistic value, Use the following formula and put the values of the sample mean, the sample standard deviation, and the sample size in this formula where the population mean is 50. To calculate the p-value for a left-tailed test, use the function t.dist where the arguments x is the t-value, the degrees of freedom is 14 and cumulative is true. Now to make decision regarding the null hypothesis, Use the function if which compares the p-value against the significance level 0.05 and return. The first result if the null hypothesis is rejected and return the second result if the null hypothesis is failed to reject. Since the p-value is less than the significance level of 0.05, the null hypothesis is rejected. Hence we will conclude that is at a 5% significant level the population mean of the sample data is significantly less than 50. Please comment down below if you have any questions relating to this topic.